Venezuela is about to ditch the dollar in major blow to the United States. Venezuelan President Nicolas Maduro said Thursday that Venezuela will be looking to free itself from the, the United States dollar next week, Reuters reports. According to the outlet, Maduro will look to use the weakest of two official foreign exchange regimes, essentially the way Venezuela will manage its currency in relation to other currencies and the foreign exchange market, along with a basket of currencies. According to Reuters, Maduro was referring to Venezuela's current official exchange rate, known as DICOM, in which the dollar can be exchanged for 3,345 bolivars. At the strongest official rate, one dollar buys only 10 bolivars, which may be one of the reasons why Maduro wants to opt for some of the weaker exchange rates. Venezuela is going to implement a new system of international payments and will create a basket of currencies to free us from the dollar, Maduro said in a multi-hour address to a new legislative superbody. He reportedly did not provide details of this new proposal. Maduro hinted that the South American country would look to using the yuan instead, among other currencies. If they pursue us with the dollar, we'll use the Russian ruble, the yuan, yen, the Indian rupee, the euro, Maduro also said. Venezuela sits on the world's largest oil reserves but has been undergoing a major crisis, with millions of people going hungry inside the country which has been plagued with rampant, increasing inflation. In that context, the recently established economic blockade by the Trump administration only adds to the suffering of ordinary Venezuelans rather than helping their plight. According to Reuters, a thousand dollars worth of local currency obtained when Maduro came to power in 2013 is now be worth little over one dollar. A theory advanced in William R. Clark's book Petrodollar Warfare and largely ignored by the mainstream media essentially asserts that Washington-led interventions in the Middle East and beyond are fueled by the direct effect on the, the United States dollar that can result if oil-exporting countries opt to sell oil in alternative currencies. For example, in 2000, Iraq announced it would no longer use the United States dollars to sell oil on the global market. It adopted the euro, instead. By February 2003, The Guardian reported that Iraq had netted a handsome profit after making this policy change. Despite this, the, the United States invaded not long after and immediately switched the sale of oil back to the, the United States dollar.